So now it's just me and this tide pool. So crazy. Oh my god, this place is so cool. My gigantic crab. Ah, in the ocean. battery life I have it. but it doesn't matter this is so cool Ooh. Uh, it's my shadow it's found a sick crab it's kind of sad but I can't do anything about it Put it back. Not only were there sculpins under, you would not believe this. Look at this. If you guys know what those are, these are purple shore crabs. Fairly good size too. And I wasn't prepared to get this on film or anything because I did something really stupid after I let go of those two purple shore crabs where I found them. Camera that I'm kind of talking to that I don't know if it's working or not. Kind of went for a swim. <laughs> yeah, but uh, I took the battery out and everything. I dried it up and I like I was really sad if it's not working because oh my god. So I found this starfish. I don't know what kind it is. I think it's a knobby starfish or a pink starfish. I don't know, but it's I don't think I've ever seen this before. It's not an okra starfish, like, the pur it's not the purple starfish. Pizaster okras, or Cretaceous, whatever. But, uh, yeah, it's kind of small. Um, but then, stranded on the rocks, I saw, found, I think it's a sea lemon, or San Diego Dord, one of those two. It's kind of orangish, so I brought it over here. There, see next to my fingers are its two eye stalks, and there's its little rear end that has like those sea anemone kind of things, protrusions. But this is so crazy. So uh, the thing is like. Min's eye candy. I think I'm attracted to most on these these parts are uh, these rocks f covered in uh, mussels. Yeah, that's like totally cool. That just means that there's life here. Rocks covered in mussels. Back there. Okra starfish. Acorn barnacles. No, no, these are acorn barnacles. These are like. Bookshot barnacles, I think. And, uh, I forgot what kind of limpet that is. Common limpet, I think. A couple oh, sea stars. And some sea anemones are close. I'm gonna my shirt. Oh! Oh my god, I knew that would happen. Oh. Okay, it was a good thing that I landed on my back and I saved the camera. I was totally trying to save the camera here. seen one of these before ever two of them oh my god oh i'm so excited oh dang horned neuterbrank oh man oh my god god i'm, I'm so, excited. so excited a real horned neuterbrank there are two too the other one's down there but oh my god oh i'm so excited I never handled these. To be honest, I don't know what this is. It's another neuter break, but yeah, it's a little different from the horn one I saw over there. But 
This is amazing. Oh, so crazy. Okay, Wait, how this tunnel. I've already seen a bunch of horn noodle rings. This other kind of noodle rings that I can't identify. And a uh, rock cub, Pacific rock cub, I'm pretty sure. Pressing onwards. Let's see what other amazing stuff I can find. Infected, um, look. Am I Grapsis organensis? Oh my god. Three Grapsis species, same type. Now, I've never seen them all at once, obviously, because this is the first time I've ever seen these ones. You see those little shrimps moving down there. There's a couple in there. Very camouflaged. Um, but either way, uh, this is crazy. Um, Grapsis, I've only ever seen these in the San Francisco Bay. I'm on the outer coast okay. of San Francisco right now. What do we have here? Man, this is crazy. That's a raw crab, by the way. But I also found this. This shell. Pick it up. Gobble kind of thing, but oh, man. That raw crab is amazing. You see it? Right there? Oh my god, man. That is amazing. Oh my god, this is the biggest line shark crab I've ever seen. Ever. Oh my god. This is the biggest line shark I've ever seen. <laughs> this is so crazy. This, this is so cool. So I was just stumbling around this like brown algae over here. Um, yeah. And you know, I usually check around these because they might have nice things in them. Usually grazers like these periwinkles, um, little slow stuff like that. But um, I mean, I stumbled upon this, which I mean, it happens to be like a uh, kelp crab nest or something. You know, I, I found this mold inside of it. I'll probably keep it later. But, um, so let's look for the kelp crabs. Where they go? Where they go? Oh, there it is. This one. Right there, it's coming out. Crab. Oh, I wouldn't see one today, but there's a hermit crab right there. This little hermit crab. Ones here have long legs, I remember. Pretty cool. Um, it's inside a oyster drill or dog well kind of thing. Um, yeah. Also, crab way down deep in there. Thinks he's safe. Woo! Oh man, waves are big. I broke, I was messing my ankle. <laughs> oh well, um, yeah. Let me catch this crab here. Crazy, huh? Crazy. I was thinking of spending a night here, but it's impossible. <laughs> this water would be freezing. Okay. I think it's a black turban snail down there. A sea anemone right there. And then a black turban snail is right there. You can go grab it. Just for you. Uh, uh, where it go? There it is. Oh, here it is. Black turban snail. Oh, that's a little periwinkle that got stuck on my... Oh yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> that was crazy. Ah, oh, the camera's gonna break. <laughs> really? Lay people. Tidepool's not big enough for all of this.
me try to catch this crab. It's pretty big. Uh, hold on. It's pretty easy to catch, I think. It doesn't look like it has anywhere to hide, so. Uh. Okay, this looks kind of retarded. Uh. Okay. I'm not killing it, don't worry. Just easing it out of its hole. Oh, wow. It's, it's pretty big. Alright, so. I'm gonna let it go. Alright. Say goodbye to this one. Put it next to the little starfish. Oops. <laughs> Doesn't know where to go. Place down in there where I cannot reach. See that crab? Well, there it goes. In there. There it goes. Well, I've never been here before. Pretty cool though. Mm. Mm, I didn't expect to find a brill star today. It's pretty cool. Oh dang, this water's kind of cool. But yeah, it's so cool. So the mud flat extends all the way to the end of the jetty or whatever you want to call it. It's at a negative tide right now. Banks. I'm at the upper and then so examples of types of whatever you want to find here. There are vanilla clams here and some regular mussels. Of course, um, there's these uh, striped shore crabs everywhere. That one. I came what I came and found what I was looking for earlier. Um, heard that these places have been are heavily populated with these They're called yellow shore crabs. Am I grabsis or I guess? Make note: I found Hemigrapsis nudus and Pachygrapsis crassipes. Same tide because it's okay. I found the biggest purple shore crab I've ever seen. Are you ready? Oh my god. I'm not ready because this is just too crazy. Look, that monster in there. That is gigantic. I don't even know how to phrase it. Okay, this. anyways. Okay, so dude, that thing is just gigantic. Okay, there's my hand on the ground next to him. It's dude, this is crazy. Later. But uh. Ah, there's a big. Here at Mile Rock Beach, finally. And the sun's almost setting, flipping over some rocks, seeing if I can find any crabs, and I haven't found any. Instead, I found a fish. A tide pool sculpin. Okay, well. Yeah. Uh, man, I can almost never come down here. The jetty at El Porto. There's the edge of the gate. We're only like 20 feet away. Oh my god. Today is my lucky day. I was looking for rock crabs like these because there's a bunch of them. But oh my god, I looked down here and there's a kelp crab. I've only seen them once here. I found three of them. Oh my god. This is so crazy. Okay, I'm gonna go look for some more.
Woo. So lucky. Found a little mantis shrimp here. It's the Matapar. Catalina. Um, it's like probably about 5.30 a.m. It's a full moon out. Tide's coming back in, but it is a negative uh, 1.7 at the peak. Which Finally! Oh my god, there it is. Chestnut calorie. Oh, time to get it. Oh my god. Oh my god. I finally it found it. Uh, I might just keep you out of this one. As I grab it from down, way down there. Wait, let me see if I can get it. Can't see it anymore. Darn it. Oh, there it is. Uh oh. Can't get it. It's under a rock. Well, I'm gonna lift up that rock right now. And just grab it. Yes! There it is. Chestnut calorie. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Here we go. Picture time, picture time. Alright, I'm done recording. See ya. You know, my life's pretty crazy. I had a lot of bad things happen these two weeks, but hey, if it ends like this at the beach, well, you know, maybe you can't control the bad things that happen, but yes, you can definitely control the good things, like this beach.